Tanya, you're an expert in development and secure coding. Okay, I want to make secure code. What do I do? Okay, so there are a few things that you need to start with. And the first one is validating every input. Whatever you are getting into your app or that could be changed by a user, you need to make sure that it's what you're expecting. If there are any special characters that are potentially dangerous, you want to escape them or sanitize them out. Okay. Then if you're going to put something on the screen, you want to output and code it. So take away all of its superpowers. So it's just text. It's just for displaying. It's not for interpreting. And then after that, every time you talk to the database, you want to make sure you use some sort of parameterized query instead of just making up your SQL on the fly. If you could do those three things, your app's going to be a lot more secure than if you just copy and paste something off of Stack Overflow. So that is a great start. Okay, but I want to learn more. Oh, I would suggest my book. And Shameless I'm plug, right? I'm obviously not biased at all. Also, my mom says it's pretty good. But you wrote this book on how to write secure code, right? Yes, that is the entire book. I cover 10 languages, eight frameworks, and a whole lot more. 